balanced diet is one which in which we avoid fast foods and we take balanced component including carbohydrates including the balanced caloric measurements in a patient or a children's diet our body needs nutrition and we are not providing that nutrition to our body when we are skipping or cut off certain amount of carbs proteins or fats from our diet Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's panel discussion on nutritional awareness. Our esteemed guests are experts in the field of medicine, here to shed light on how nutrition impacts overall health and to debunk some common misconceptions about healthy eating. Without further ado, let's welcome our panelists, Dr. Ahmed Rasa, Dr. Maham Farooq, and Dr. Kainat Mustafa. <laughs> to kick things off, let's delve into our first question. How does nutrition impact overall health and what are some common misconceptions about healthy eating? They say balanced diet leads to healthy life and prevent many diseases. And balanced diet is one which in which we avoid fast foods and we take balanced component including carbohydrates, proteins, fats, water and fibers. The basic nutrition we call as a balanced diet affects the development and growth of children to a very much extent. A balanced diet is very important for the development of children, uh, including the balanced caloric measurements in a patient or a children's diet. We can how we can achieve this as children are more into having junk food, having carbonated drinks and beverages, and eating less of a home cooked food. So we can. balance the diet we can add uh, both like the home cooked elements as well as the uh, junk food as well but to a balance and an equal quantities that it should not affect the children's health uh, for the healthy eating there is a very common misconception that we should avoid uh, the food or meals like we should avoid dinners or breakfast that's not a long term solution exactly what we are doing by doing this we are skipping the meals and our body needs nutrition and we are not providing that nutrition to our body when we are skipping or cut off certain amount of carbs proteins or fats from our diet thank you for those insights now on to our next question what are some practical tips for individuals to make healthier food choices and maintain a balanced diet unhealthy diet can lead to diseased conditions like obesity which indirectly affect every single system of your body these patients may end up in raised blood pressure diabetes increased incidence of heart attack and stroke along with back ache uh, knee joint pains and many other problems associated with obesity what we need is portion controlled diet we need to eat healthy food but in small portion small interval of time after some time we should add some uh, amount of food in our meals but we should not skip it as it's not the long term solution for the obesity and it is going to cause the malnutrition and our body needs vitamins and we are not going to provide it if we are skipping the meals uh common misconceptions in healthy eating include the having a lot of junk food i would say even having burgers and crisps and these all things add up to a very sedentary or uh, not a good balanced uh, life or diet of a patient so uh, we should eliminate that rather we can encourage a having more fruits vegetables and home cooked meals like having a good portion of meat in the uh, children's diet and milk and protein and eggs should be added to the uh, children's diet thank you to our esteemed panelists for sharing your expertise and insights today and thank you to our audience for joining us remember knowledge is power when it comes to nutrition make informed choices and prioritize your health goodbye for now and stay well <laughs>